This video is a short primer on how to use the asset browser in KRK2. Most of the assets in KRK2 are loaded into the asset browser in the left panel. One thing to note here is that if you don't see the categories in the asset browser, it's probably because you're missing the text file that should accompany the blend file that holds category information. Besides the board models and the caps map, there are many other materials material utilities, and assets that you'll find useful for keyboard rendering. For example, one useful utility is the standard color palette, which can be used to switch between colors on the fly. The asset browser is also where you'd find layouts that you can use to populate your own keyboard models. Let's have a look at the accessories. Drag and drop them into the 3D viewport. Position them where you would want them. Then click the Restore Collections button to make them editable. That's it for the Asset Browser.